Hello, all YouTubers and all YouTubers. I'm the Random Bagotta, and today I'm revamping the series. The main YouTube survival, because I wasn't happy with it. It was getting kind of boring for me, so I've revamped it. So now, instead of just a normal survival, because, you know, you've seen loads of those on YouTube already, so how about an OP survival? I, I ain't seen that on YouTube, mainly, mainly because I don't actually look at survivals. I don't look on YouTube deliberately for other people's survivals to get ideas. I just think of something and then just go with it. And if someone else has done it, then, well, whoopie do. We'll probably come up with the same idea at some point. So, this is an OP world. And I was thinking, it doesn't look like it. But, um, as soon as you go in a cave, you'll see what on earth has happened to the systems. Because, uh, it's, um, when I say OP, I mean OP. <laughs> now, when it comes to OP here, I, um, only go in to what Minecraft would allow, so no, like, special commands. So like, no actual editing. It's like, you got your dungeons, the max is like 100. I haven't edited it so you can get, like, more than 100. So, uh, that's easy to guess. One thing I'm going to change though is the uh, random tick speed. Just get things out of the way, you see. So, um, yeah, this is kind of more chill survival now. This is the sort of stuff I actually want to do. This feels like something that I want to do. It's a chill. OP survival world. I've already got one of these on like peaceful. I've already got a peaceful version. Which I do change difficulty often. It's a world I just go in when I'm bored. Well, used to. Go in it ever so often. But yeah, I go I go in that world. I don't recall it because it's my private world. And no, it's not dirty minded, thank you very much. It's just a world I don't really feel like recording. I think I did actually show it off in um, my newest video, showing off worlds. Yeah. So it made it into a video. I think I've gone on long enough. I think it's time that we found a cave. So I can show off this amazing world. And uh, we can't seem to find any. And I'm out of, I'm out of food already. So... I'm just going peaceful so I can get from in again. Ah, there's a big hole. Ah, yes, there we go. Oh, oh, oops. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Hey, is this a ravine? Oh, no. Close, though. Okay, we can get out, that's nice. So, yeah, th this um, should not be spawning this high up, should it? See, yeah, this is what I mean by OP survival. And this actually feels like something I want to do. So, I think I'm going to stick with this. I've done many OP survivals just off camera. And some of them turned out alright, some of them turned out bad. But the one that stayed was the world I, I'm always mentioning, which is just the world that I go on. Anyway, we're just gonna um, get wood, I guess. And uh, we'll make ourselves a diamond pickaxe in about a minute. Let's see. So, crafting table. Done. Where's stone when you need it? There's some stone. So, we need stone for the furnace and a stone pick. Let's just get down here again. What? Let's just jump down. What's the worst that could happen? There we go. We're down. Some grass. It's a lot of redstone. I bet Mumbo Jumbo would love this world. No wait, a, a redstone only world. That would be uh, interesting. So some, someone do that. I'm going to put Phoenix, Phoenix SC's channel in the description as well because I know that he likes to muck around on Minecraft and break it and how the hell did I even get down here? Oh well. Right, I'm going to sneeze. Oh no. Hold on. Don't you hate it when your brain tricks you? 
you know, he's like, you think you're gonna sneeze and then you don't. I didn't actually sneeze. So, uh, that, that was great. Thanks, Brain, for interrupting my recording. Well, I wasn't. Oh, I don't know. Thanks for interrupting my recording. Sneeze. It's still, still there a little bit, so I don't know if I'm going to do it again. God damn it. So, we have a furnace. We need coal. Where's the coal at? There's some coal. Perfect. Just that one piece is all we need. I was thinking that ain't enough. Apparently this one piece of coal is enough to smell all the meat irons. In no time. So. We also have some diamond, we have some gold, so we have enough to make golden apple. I think we're gonna live here. Now, not in the cave system, but just up there. We're gonna live like up there. Relatively close to all this. And everything should be good. Right, you've got three done. Yeah. Let's look, stop. Trying to interrupt my recording body. Right. So let's get that done. By the way, and I think it is now time. There we go. Easy peasy. Got diamonds. I was thinking, well, this is far too OP. That's the exact point. But hey. It's a chill world, once you like this. Once you've got a world like this, it's more chill than anything. Oh, let's get a bit of redstone. Might need that. And, uh, and now we make the pick. And now we have a diamond pick, instantly. Yes, it's OP. Yes, I've said it numerous times. Get over it. If you don't, if you don't like this series, then, well, tough, it's my channel. <laughs> don't like it, just go watch the old one for about 17 episodes. I didn't go too well. It was alright, but it's like I did like three blooming episodes on just building the house. Just the house. Oh, god damn it, lag. Get out of my face. Just the house. Three episodes. So you can tell that I wasn't really coming up with any ideas. I was just like, let's build a house. We haven't built it, let's just keep building, I guess. Still haven't built it, let's just make an episode that says finish the house already or something like that. So yeah, I just didn't really have any ideas. Hopefully with this one, we'll have a fresh start. Hmm. Some lapis, we're gonna need that. Some gold for golden apples in case we need it. Now, one thing I am I want to do, but I kind of don't want to do at the same time, is a 404 survival. So if you don't know what the 404 challenge is, then, um... Have you been living in a cave? It's literally everywhere. Anyway. Back in the, um... Olden days of Minecraft, you had a world with the seed 404. Well, it seems like a really simple seed, nothing special. Apparently, it, um, well, not always, but in that world, there is a large sinkhole which is made of gravel. If you update the gravel, it will break and thus revealing the sinkhole. And the challenge is, during that one Minecraft day, you would go get as many resources as you can in the surface and then, once the day's over like this, get in the hole and stay there. Forever. I want to say it's like Hermitcraft because Hermits live underground, don't they? So I want to say it's like that, but I think Hermits can actually go back up to the surface whenever they want. I don't know. And also, part of the challenge is no light sources, so you can't use torches. Lava's fine, I guess, because that's natural. So no unnatural light sources. So that's fun. So that means you can't prevent mobs from spawning. Good 
I was in the middle of explaining something bandicam. Oh god damn it. Get there. You saw nothing. That happens. I don't know why that happens. Press it to feature Windows. Thanks, Windows. So, I think we're going to do 20 minute episodes right at the beginning. And for those wondering, what about inverted survival? That's technically OP once you get diamonds. Or, like, once you get iron, then you've got diamonds, which uh, spawn at the same level as coal. So then, you're easy and ready to go. So, yeah, I get that, but. Eh. I get it. Coal is now hard to find, so we can just use charcoal, but. Eh, I don't know. It's a weird series I decided to make. Just for fun. And we're only on episode 3. Now, the Showing Off Wars video, I was going to make that as episode 4. But uh, I, d I didn't have any ideas, so I just decided to show off worlds instead. Yeah. Oh, we need we need a uh, we need an axe, don't we? How did I forget an axe? Right. Let's make an axe. There we go. Right, you're fine there. Let's go back up and get some trees and stuff. Yes, trees and stuff. That's what I call them now. Calling them trees and stuff. Oh, here's a good thing. It takes forever to get up here because blocks in the way. There's no blocks in the way, you go up faster. But as you can see, it's not really happening. We haven't, we haven't actually made a torch yet. I'm just realising we haven't made any torches. We need to go and make or some. Don't see me, please. Right, so back up on the surface. Nice flowers. I might do a, I might do a, a, a question of the video. I said a question of the day because I, I don't upload every day. I want to though, but I can't. So let's go and get some some wood, and then. Hmm. Well, there's a point. Where where are we actually going to live? Clear that out of the river. That made no sense. Clear that out of the river. Wait, there's a plains over here, isn't there? Plains biome. Let's go steal some grass from over there. Yeah, perfect. And there's some lava over there. Some natural light sources. Oh, here's a random fact to keep you interested. Did you know that Bethesda has hidden the original Skyrim from the Steam Star Search? That's, say that five times fast. Steam Star Search. Oof. They've hidden the original Skyrim from the search. So if you go search for Skyrim, only this special edition will pop up. I find that really evil because I want Skyrim. Sure, I probably won't be able to run it, but I still want it. Why? I like Skyrim. And because PC. Eh, I don't know. I hear it's coming to the Switch. But whether that is true or not, I don't know. I hope it I hope it's coming to the Switch. It's probably gonna be a special edition, but I don't care because heck I'll have it on the Switch. So what we're gonna do here is gonna cut off this river. I'm just gonna have it as a house that we're gonna live on. Um, hmm. So, now what? what? What we do now? What we do, in fact, need a, um, a chest. Ooh, I forgot to enable a game rule. Hold on. Let me enable the, a really cheaty game rule once I make a chest. Some of you probably know what I'm trying to enable already. There we go. Oh, there's a chill world. 
I don't want to lose all my stuff. And I think we're kind of close to the spawn area. I'm not sure. So, now what? Uh, yeah, this this is the problem with me and my videos. Seeing as I don't have a script, I um, I don't know what to say or do in the video. So I'm kind of wandering around aimlessly while thinking of something, and that takes ages. I'm usually wasting my recording time as well. So by the time I've finished, I've got like. 10 minutes of me doing absolutely nothing while trying to come up with an idea on what to do in that 10 minutes. So then I'm like, well that was a waste of time. And I don't really like using a script because, well, that's exactly what it is. It's scripted, so it's supposed to happen in the episode. But in Minecraft, it's hard to script it. Because you never know what might happen. It's like, you, if you script that you're going to go out and just go for a stroll around your world, then suddenly a creeper pops up out of nowhere. you got nothing in your script that says, Oh my god, there's a creeper. I wonder what I should do. Let's go kill it. Yeah. That's why I don't have script. I should probably use one. At least once anyway. Just to get a feel for it. And if I don't like scripts, then I'll just go back to normal. I guess. But also the time consuming and the paper. Well, not exactly paper, but I don't have a lot of storage left on my computer now. It's all thanks to Steam. Thanks, Steam. It's taken up so much room. All in games. I don't even have many games in there. We've only got like 30. <laughs> I'm thinking 30 is a lot, but for a hardcore Steam fan? Not really. I'm not a hardcore Steam fan. Fab fan. Yeah. I just go play games because I like to. Not because I have to. If that makes any sense whatsoever. Right, so, um, we've got ourselves some stuff. Is there any coal in here? Yes, there is. Just a bit. Hmm. Right. So, what I am thinking of doing is doing this stuff. And then coming back until I at least have a house because put it this way, I need a house. Also, I just want to show off the launcher. They fixed it. And what do I mean by that? If you were to go press play, it won't crash the game anymore. Yes, that's really old news. <laughs> now I felt like showing off. Also, just a random thing. Do I, do I mumble too much in my videos or talk too fast? Because I'm, I'm still working on that. It's like, my mic is far enough from it for probably you guys to hear, but it's just the fact that I might talk too fast for you guys to understand what I'm saying. But if I talk slow, then me giving out the information, whether it be useless or not, gets out slower. And I'm... And I'm used to talking fast. To the point where not even my mum understands what I'm on about at times. Yeah. It's like, what? What, what did you just say? I, I, I didn't. And I'm like, well, you have ears, use them. Like, yeah, I have ears, but um, I have no idea what you just said because you spoke too fast for me to hear. Oh, one thing I do hate though, is like when you, when someone does know what you're on about, or like when someone does in fact listen to you, they understand what you just said, and then they say, what? I was like, what? It's like, I just said it to you. Use your brain to convert that text into a description or something like that. I think the worst has got to be like on messages. I was like, the text is right in front of you. Someone says what? So I'm like, just read it again if you don't understand it. <laughs> I don't know if that's just me, but I get quite annoyed when people do that. Not really annoyed, but... Oh wait, cutscene. Why did I say cutscene? 
cut, it's not a cutscene. We're not cutscene into <laughs> to anything. Yeah, I'm not good with this, am I? Is this going to be a 30-minute episode? It's going to be the pilot episode, so I guess it. I don't think it's not the pilot, but the very first episode was the pilot, and that was 10 minutes. 10 minutes, woo! What can you do in 10 minutes? Not a lot, by the way. Oh, it's like seriously. The amount of the amount of stuff you could do in 10 minutes as a kid compared to what you can do in 10 minutes now. Ooh. It's unbelievably short. Like as a kid, you could probably um, I don't know build a whole train set. Um, go outside. Complete 50 levels of Mario and build a giant house in Minecraft. And now, when you get older, because of how slow time seems to go, normally, but when you go to the game in minute, everything just goes shoom, and then you're like, what? I'm guessing that's because, as a kid, we interpret time as being super slow because maybe, maybe because there's nothing to do, so we have to entertain ourselves in some way. That's just my personal experience, because, I think about it, when you're a kid, you've got nothing to do. Especially for, like, the adults that were kids, they had, like, no internet at all. So they literally had to come up with their own ways. I'm not dissing on them, right? I respect them, because they had to come up with their own ways. And now, now look at us, look at our generation. Computers, literally everywhere. And yes, I'm counting smartphones as computers because that's technically what they are. Anyway, I'm rambling on too much. So there's another problem. I ramble on too much about a certain topic. And then I've wasted minutes again. And I'm like, where'd the time go? Anyway, I've said that enough times. Um. Hmm. Let's see. I need, I need a decent area to build my house. Also, I, I really hate how this hitbox works now. And look, the hitbox is there, but the flower's like halfway out. I, I know in the Xbox version, well, my outdated version, I, I haven't updated that because I can't. I don't even want to, I can't be bothered. <laughs> so, in my outdated Xbox version, the flower is inside the hitbox, like it's supposed to be. So I mean, you can get nice neat flowers. But, um, I guess the only reason they've done it is to make it look a bit more realistic. But since when has Minecraft been realistic? I mean, look, look, or, already. But this is, um, not, not realistic at all. I can do realistic in one block. There. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Do we have more? Yes, we do have more dirt. I thought we had some more. I remember mining some. Oh, so here's a, here's a random question. What are your thoughts on the Mandela effect? I've watched a few videos on this. I'm kind of freaked out by it. I'm like, what? Ooh, I hear noises outside. Probably my neighbours. Hello, neighbours. No, not hello, neighbour. Don't, I don't have the game. I don't really want it. Hello Neighbors is an interesting game. And the title is... I would say it's kind of misleading, but it isn't at the same time. Because with Hello Neighbor, it's like, you just go out to your neighbor's house and go, Hello, how are you doing fam? Nah. This neighbor's not for this culture. It's, it's a grumpy old git. <laughs> oh yes, he's a grumpy old git. Anyway. We really need to build a house. We have not done anything again. I've got materials, but then that's as far as we go. See, that is the problem. That's as far as I go. I should get the materials, and that's about it. Anyway. Right, now we have wood, so I think we can start building. So, what I plan on doing is... Uh, let's see. Hmm. So, this is a bridge to the other side. Nice river crossing there. Let's build a house over the water. So what I want to do is maybe that. Okay. 
This is going to be fun to build, isn't it? Uh, a house over water. Why, why did I decide to do this? I'm stupid. Yeah, we can make fences later. Also, 1.7. The craft recipe for fences is extremely different. I thought it'd be like, you know, having, uh, I don't have any room to show off. There we go, there's a bit of room. I thought it'd be like this, this, and then this, but apparently no. Apparently it's all just sticks. I'm like, what? Since when? Is it all sticks? But when did I decide to use sticks to make what I need to make? Okay, let's go one more. I'm guessing that's just 1.7 because fence gates, they're made in the opposite direction to fences, so I, I don't know really. Right. Question Should this be the base? And I'll like have stairs that'll go in. I'll just walk up to. Yeah, I think I'll have stairs. I, I don't know actually. Yeah, I think I'll make it as stairs. I'm, oh, for goodness sake. <sighs> also, how many of you actually saw the solar eclipse? I didn't actually see it because I'm in Britain. So, uh, I, I didn't see it. I want to see it. Because it, it is a rare opportunity. I remember, like, one time when I was in, like, high school, um, there was, I think it was only, like, a partial eclipse, but even so, it was still an eclipse. I was in English, right? I couldn't go out to see it. Well, technically, the entire class was not allowed to go out to see this rare event. And I'm like, but everyone else is probably going out. Why not us? I was like, come on. Do you understand how rare this is? Sure, it's not like Haley's Comet rare type of thing, but for us, as kids, this is something that we want to see. Oh heck, it probably science teachers would be like, "Whoa, you get a um, boosted grade for seeing the eclipse." I don't know. Oh, it's, it's, oh, frame rate. What do you do? What are you doing, frame rate? God, stop. Okay, so I've actually made a bit of progress now. That's good. That is good. So, I've actually made the start of house right quick. And um. Yeah, I think we're actually going to end the episode soon. Like 30 blooming minutes. Jesus. Wow, 30 minutes for, for a single episode of Minecraft. Well, I've well, seen worse anyway. Uh, let's see. A bit more there. A bit more of you. I don't mind breaking that. Um. I think I'll get a bit more wood and then end the episode off because we're getting close to the minutes. Don't want this to go on forever. My file storage, my file sizes are still stupidly high. Apparently it's like one gig for 10 minutes in Minecraft. It's weird. I don't know if it's just Minecraft that's doing that because other times when I've recorded 10 minutes it's not as big so it's probably just Minecraft and how much memory it takes up. So then Bandicam needs more memory to do so. I don't know. Also, as much as I want to crop out the logo, I can't without cutting out some of the gameplay. Because... I, I would show you, but I'd have to move the window and I can't be bothered. Right. Let's actually... Uh, uh, do the fences right quick. If we can. Oh, good. Fences! We have three fen we have three fences. Whoa. Three fences. I've not seen so much. Well then. I um I guess I'll have to end the video. There isn't really much more I can do. I can go in here to get some air. But um Yeah. If you liked it, then as always subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time. In the revamp. See ya.